welcome back in this video i will discuss how to find the correlation between the dependent variable y and independent variable x and predict the value of y given the value of x using linear regression algorithm with the help of simple solved example so this is the given data set first what we need to do we need to find the correlation between x and y after that we need to develop a linear regression model that is y is equal to b0 plus b1 into x after that we need to find the y value when x is equal to 2.5 so first we will compute the correlation coefficient that is r this is a given data set in this we have four data point because of that we are getting n is equal to 4 to find the r value we need to use the following equation that is r is equal to n into summation of xy minus uh, summation of x into summation of y whole divided by square root of bracket n into summation of x square minus summation of x bracket square bracket complete bracket n into summation of y square minus summation of y bracket square bracket complete so here we need to find the summation of xy summation of y summation of x and summation of x square and summation of y square so here we have only x and y for that we need to find all these values so first we need to find the summation of x summation of x is nothing but we need to add all these values so we will get a summation of x as 10 so we need summation of y so summation of y is nothing but we need to add all these values we will get the summation of y as 20 so again we need to find the summation of xy for that first we need to multiply x into y so here we need to multiply these two columns we will get this column so after that we need to add all those values we will get a summation of xy as 58 so next we need to find the x square again we need to add all those values we will get summation of x square as 30 similarly summation of y square as 114 so once you find all these values we need to put all these values in this equation so r is equal to 4 that is number of data points into summation of xy that is 58 minus summation of x that is 10 into summation of y that is 20 whole divided by square root of 4 into summation of x square summation of x square is 30 minus summation of x that is 10 whole square into 4 into summation of y square that is 114 minus summation of y summation of y is 20 square so once you simplify this one we will get r is equal to point 956 which is nearly equal to 1 it means it exists a strong positive correlation so after that we need to compute the linear regression equation that is y is equal to b0 plus b1 into x here we need to find the uh, slope and intercept values that is b1 and b0 values to find the b1 and b0 values we need to use the following formulas that is b1 is equal to n into summation of xy minus summation of x into summation of y whole divided by n into summation of x square minus summation of x bracket square already we found the values of summation of xy summation of x summation of y and summation of x square just we need to replace those values here so we will get b1 is equal to 1.6 so after that we need to find the b0 to find the b0 we need to use this formula that is b0 is equal to y bar minus b1 into x bar so we know the value of b1 we need to find the value of y bar and x bar to find the value of x bar we need to use this one that is x bar is equal to summation of x divided by n which is equal to 10 divided by 4 which is equal to 2.5 so to find the y bar y bar is equal to summation of y divided by n which is equal to 20 divided by 4 which is equal to 5 so once you find x bar and y bar we need to put those values in this equation so we will get b0 is equal to 5 minus 1.6 into 2.5 which is equal to 1 
so here we found the value of b0 and b1 we need to put these two values in the linear regression equation that is y is equal to b0 plus b1 into x so we will get the linear regression equation as y is equal to 1 plus 1.6 into x so after that we need to predict the y value for x is equal to 2.5 simply we need to replace x by 2.5 so we will get y is equal to 1 plus 1.6 into 2.5 which is equal to 5 this is how we can find the correlation and we can find the linear regression after that we can predict the y value for the given x i hope the concept of linear regression algorithm is clear if you like the video do like and share with your friends press the subscribe button for more videos press the bell icon for regular updates thank you for watching